I got brides in Atlanta, she's a dolly in the family, credit cards in the scammers, getting no licks in the van. Legacy. Fuck is up. You already know what the fuck time it is. It's another episode of the goddamn nasty sports update. Today we are sponsored, yet unsponsored by AA, Alcoholics Anonymous. Because through this quarantine, I've been drinking way more than usual. And if you know me, that ain't a good fucking thing. Let's get into, I guess, a couple topics. Um, Yeah, I did that shit. You heard it, and I did it, bitch. Um, Chris Johnson out here murdering for hire. Murder for hiring niggas, huh? Wild ass boy, I always knew. Niggas that got quick twitches, twitching the neck. Something wrong with him. Something wrong with that boy. And, he, and he, you know, innocent until proven guilty, but uh, something about them niggas with twitches. I know, it's, they, they mind just a little different. Um, LeBron says, if the season doesn't come back correctly, that... It's gonna be uh, some. She's gonna be missing some closure, and as I keep saying all these weeks, we losing out on on the last pieces of Brian, you know, and that that's really, really fucked up, really, really fucked up. And I'm and I'm, the more and more I come to the realization, the more and more it's starting to seem like it probably won't come back. It got to be back by at least the end of June, but even still, it's it's you know the pundits. Skip Bayless bum ass if if you know if LeBron wins is gonna have some negative to say about it. And a lot of people are gonna have stuff to say about it, but it so it's just like fuck, bro. It's fuck. Um Roger Goodell says, hey bro, NFL starting on time. Nigga said, and if you don't believe me. And if you try to talk to me about some shit, it's a it's a punishable offense. Now I don't know what that means, punishable, but I think dog is trying to say if you say some 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 dumb shit to me, I'm on your ass and I could fire you. That nigga's a wild ass boy, but you know uh, that's that nigga's wild. Um. Shit, we talked about John Jones a couple of weeks back. Daniel Cormier weighed in his arch nemesis and said, you know, you know, you know, he he tries to not be, you know, critique him that much because that nigga done got his ass beat by that nigga a million times. But yeah, and still, you know, it still came off kind of snobby. But what he said basically is kind of the truth. I mean, niggas that be having fucked up drinking and drug problems. You know, when they ain't got shit to do, <laughs> saying, it, especially after I just said what I said in the beginning, that, you know, I don't mind devil playground. And you're going to do wild shit. Uh, you know, but hope John Jones get the help he need. Um, looks like, I think it looks like they're probably going to cancel Cancel the Olympics, but I mean, outside of when Michael Phelps was swimming and Simone Biles and Usain Bolt was running and a little bit of the basketball stuff, like who the fuck watches the Olympics? I'm not watching no javelin throwing competitions and shot put and what, what's the shit where they jump over the damn use a stick to jump over a goddamn whatever bar. What's that shit called? I don't know. But I seen a nigga, that stick break, and it went through a nigga one time. And I said, yep, that's about enough for this. I had a nigga kill himself trying to fight for his country. Nah, bro. Nah, nah, nah. I was good on that. I don't know, man. I hope all y'all niggas are staying safe out here. I seen some niggas at the park hooping. I said, oh, them niggas dumb. I don't know, bro. Jordan documentary coming soon. Shit. 
I, I don't know much else. I don't know much else to talk about, man. I'm out here in nature. There's some ducks right here in my lake. They fighting right now. You know, or these ain't ducks, them geese. But, you know, geese, them niggas some assholes on the low. So I'm trying to keep my distance. Because them niggas ain't playing no games right now. But, I mean, you know it's bad when a nigga talking about sports, but I actually got to talk about geese fight. Geese fights, shit. That's, um, that's almost what uh, Mike Vick with the prison folk. It's the white version of what Mike Vick would go to prison for. A geese fight. Hey, man. I appreciate y'all for tuning in. This is another episode, you know, of the greatest. The, the non-really uh, informative sports commentary in under 10 minutes. We'll see you next time.